Welcome back to the kingdom. This is King Rev, and we are playing Car Manufacturer Tycoon again. And this is our fifth episode, I believe. Thank you so much for the nice comments that a few of you have uh, left on this series. And it's uh, my best series as of to date. And thank you for those that have subscribed to the channel from my uh, last several videos. So I really do appreciate all the support. Well, we are trying to play this fun game to be able to figure out how we can advance... We are number 64 on the list. There we are, Kingdom Auto, all the way down the far left corner. And we are trying to beat Pathfinder Motors. That would be nice too, which is a cool name actually. We have two car designs. And what I want to be able to do in this episode is to be able to play around with the designs and see if we can't kind of unlock what it is to be able to create a car that just everybody wants and sells well. I have a beta design is a compact coupe, and then I have a Rev Compact sal uh, Salon that um, are our two blueprint designs. Now, if you look at where it says show details, if I just click beta design show details, it gives me some information. Now, this was before the blueprint update. Um, the Now the blueprint is different, and there's a little bit more control you have in designing the car, which is neat. It's a lot of fun to be able to do that. But um, this was before that. So we have, if you look down through there, there's uh, the production name, beta design, identifiers 102, blueprint age, one. I think that is probably one month old. Um, uh, it's about as long as I've been playing this game. Units sold. We've sold 50 of these cars. And then look at that next thing. It's the automotive rating. We are an 80 at automotive rating. That's pretty good. Um, at least what I think. There may be cars that are getting 100. I don't know. Uh, but I'll show you a difference when we look at the next one in a moment. Earnings from sales of this car, we've made over a half a million bucks selling this uh, this car. If you look down here, the technical information, the design configuration is a coupe, interior finish aluminum, exterior accents, we didn't do any. Suspension height is 10, uh, basic platform, and then the fuel source is petrol. So if I go ahead, let's see if I can click off of this, there it is. Let's look at the second, the, the rev car, and we'll click show details there and see the differences there. If you look down there, yeah, blueprint age, I haven't had it for a month yet. Unit sold, we sold 40, but then look, look at the automotive rating. Our last one was 80, this one, the rev one, is a 46 automotive rating. That, that to me is a failing grade. We still have made money, earnings from the sales, 368,000. But then as I look down through there, I have to figure out which one of these particulars underneath the technical information do we need to change to be able to bump that up. Our interior finish was leather, exterior accent was aluminum, suspension height was uh, 12 centimeters, uh, the platform, basic platform, it's petrol, it's top speed, 158 kilometers. That goes um, 0 to 60 in 5.91 seconds, so it's under 6 seconds. Uh, you see the power, the fuel consumption. I think the more that we mess with these numbers, the better that that rating is going to go uh, go up. I also am suspicious of the game that it may have adjusted these automotive ratings now that you have a little bit more control on how you adjust these parameters under the technical information. So that is definitely something to kind of consider. I know that's a lot of technical, but... If you're someone that likes this game, you're kind of thinking through the technical ramifications of that, which is a neat concept, uh, that you have a lot more control in your tycoon. There's a lot of tycoon games that are almost click-like tycoon games, that as long as you can tap the screen, you do what you're supposed to do. This, of course, is not. So it costs quite a bit just to make a blueprint. So what I'm thinking is, let's go back. <clears throat> we have just under a million dollars. Now, we, I think it was last episode, we spent some money trying to make sure that our tech was up. And I'm trying to remember which button it is. Yes. Research and development is under the, um, the uh, money sign symbol there. And when I go to research and development, here's where we're at now. Uh, we are working on technologies and platforms. Uh, the more cars we make, those go up. The more blueprints we have, those go up. So uh, that's kind of neat. We did add, unlock a few things there. And if you look here, we have put five research, five points into research. 
um, five in the consumption emissions, two to brakes, two to chassis and suspension, four to gearbox, two to the electronic circuits. How do you do that? It's right down here in the car design. Um, and uh, this this is something that I have learned through this. Just because you hit conduct re research, notice if it's the car design team, you're gonna spend $39,000. Um, and there's not necessarily a guarantee that you will actually go up one. Um, you might spend the 39000 and still not get the point. So um, I'm sure there is a percentage oh, uh, wise that that would be, but um, I haven't quite got that figured out, hoping to in the near future. So, okay, let's design a car, shall we? I'm going to go ahead... Ah, uh, boy. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to design another car. Let's have some fun with it, huh? I'm going to hit blueprints, and we're going to do another blueprint. we got to be careful uh, because we don't have a ton of money. Set car name. This car name is going to be called, um, let's see, what do we want to call this name? We're going to call it uh, the Panther. Just for fun there car identifier. We'll call it pan one. And we're going to go for speed with this. Uh, okay, done. And we've got that set. Design. <clears throat> Oop, I must have not hit something here. Uh, this is going to be a new car. Um, select the car type. We're still locked, so it has to be a compact. Select the platform, basic platform. Now I can should be able to move on to design. All right, we're going to set the branding. We're going to do a back logo and a steering wheel logo. And let's see, we're going to put that also where? How about uh, on the airbags? That's how we're going to do it. Confirm that. We're going to set the interior. And we've already spent 400000 to get a new design. So let's go with a, um, hmm. <laughs> let's go ahead and go with a carbon interior. Let's just go all out for this. Let's give it a two passenger doors. We're gonna set the exhaust. We're gonna go dual both sides. Confirm. Uh, set the suspension. I'm gonna have one about 12 centimeters. Uh, set the color. Black is always available. I'm assuming then, then black is the way it starts, and we're going to have it be black. Um, and then we're going to do, let's go ahead and spend the money on the fastback there. Now, I'm wondering if it, okay, set the exterior now. Let's see, plastic, aluminum, steel, or lacquer. Um, I'm going to go with a aluminum, and let's, Let's give this a whirl, shall we? Motion. Now we're going to set the power source is going to be petrol. Now here we go. I've got 30 points. This thing needs to be fast. And right now, the speed is uh, 0 to 60 is 7.45. Let's really dump it into performance. I'm just going to go crazy on performance here. 22 performance. Um, I've got 10 points left. Let's try to see if we can't move the needle on some of these. Notice when I put in some points, it doesn't do anything, right? So we want to see what we can do. There we go. I don't know if this is really going to help. Helps a little bit. Power source capacity consumption. This is a jacked up car, but it's fast. Uh, let's give it a shot here. Let's see what we can do. We've used all of our points. So we put 20 points in performance, two in consumption, six in emission, and two in the power source capacity. So there we go. It goes zero to 60 and 4.65. This sucker is moving. Now show me the details. All right, now this is what it's telling me. It's going to cost us $640,000 to research this. Um, let's see. Uh, this car blueprint is classy. Uh, the performance is 66. The efficiency is 26. And the utility is 6. So the market trend is they want a regular car. 
Oh, we're not doing that. We're doing a class car. So that might be an issue. Our performance is huge. It's out of this world. Our efficiency and our utility. Our efficiency is about right. Okay. And then our utility is nowhere near. Um, I could try to dump some of that back. Let me see if I can go back. Let's go motion. If I take just a little bit this away. Because it's two points, three points. And I try to put it where? Let's try to dump it into power source. Okay, I'm going to take one more away because it didn't really do anything there. And we'll dump it back into performance. Uh, actually, we're going to take that away and we'll put it into consumption. Let's just try that. Let's just try that and see where we're at now. Okay, show details. Okay, that made this a little bit better closer. Now we're correct on the efficiency, but our performance is way high. Hmm. <laughs> I'm going to try that. I'm going to try that. Let's research it. The Panther. Confirm your new compact Panther. Research the blueprint. Confirm. Car has been researched. Important. You may need to select this as your active blueprint in order to produce and sell it. Absolutely. That's what we're doing right now. So it is, okay, it is set for our active. Notice it's got the, um, the, the check mark to the right. Let's see if we can sell this car and how well it does. <clears throat> if I show details, as you can see, it goes right down there. Our auto automotive rating is 64. So it's not the 80, but it's better than the 46 that we have. So let's see how well we can sell this car. I'm going to go to company bank suggest requesting a bank and investment or filing bankruptcy. <laughs> hey, we, we, we're still okay. We're still okay. Uh, nobody freak out yet. Let's go to sell some cars. We're going to sell some cars. This car is going to sell. And if it doesn't, we're in big trouble. Okay, it's not letting me buy money. Let me go back. <clears throat> we may need to manage our stock and bring this up to some other quality here. Um, hmm. <laughs> I need to buy. How many can I buy here? Never really had to fool around with this too much. 30. Let's do uh, 25. Let's do 50. And let's go to plastics. We're going to do 200. And I'm going to go done. Does that give me enough? I don't think I purchased anything. Hmm. No, that's not what I wanted. Go back. Go back. Nope. I don't want an exit. Uh, let's go to assets and venture. No, that's not what I wanted. Sorry. I'm trying to figure it out here. Let's just see if we can sell cars now. It is not letting me buy the cars. So I need to, I need the units. So let's go back, let's go to manage stock. Okay, let me just see if I bought that. Okay, let me ixnay this, buy 50, buy, wow. I think this is why we're in trouble here. Buy 20, buy, okay. And then buy this one. Oh my. Okay, okay, I bought that for that. All right, let's buy another 20 here. Boom. Okay, we're down to $96,000. Let's please let me be able to, to do this. Let's try it now. Okay, here we go. Now it's moving. Now we had enough. We have now have 10 units. We have enough to make 20 units. Are you ready to do this? We're going to go... Um, set the retail price at twelve thousand. Let's go twelve nine nine nine. Okay, done. And then we are going to do price is negotiable. Okay, let's do this. I'm ready. Produce and sell cars. 
Each unit will be sold for twelve thousand nine nine nine. Wait a second. Okay, if the price is not set to be negotiable, continue. Hold on, cancel. Let me just think about this one more time. I didn't see a comma there. And that comma did scare. Well, no, I don't have the ability to do a comma. So produce. We're doing it. Produce. Here we go. Boom. Okay, we have some that want to buy our car. Good. Um, <clears throat> not not as enough as we need, but we did have three that are going to buy it at the twelve thousand nine nine nine. So boom, there's that. And then we've got well, we can sell it to everybody. Everybody else is under what we really were looking for at the nine seven five zero nine thousand seven hundred fifty. Let's go ahead and sell them all. We had six cars left, so 30% of our 20 didn't sell. That's not great. All the other six are going to be sold for $1,500. we are going to confirm and sell. Yep, confirm. And there we go. We lost money. Isn't that wonderful? So we uh, sold, let's see, total earnings to sell is $176,247. Uh, but it, approximate resource was $178,800, which means... We lost $2,553. Transfer that amount of money to the bank, and we're back to $272,570. So <clears throat> not all cars are going to be winners. Uh, this video shows that. But really interesting to be able to, to watch this and look through this. Have fun. Tweak your designs. You can have a lot of fun. And our Kingdom Auto is struggling greatly. But um, tune us back the next episode. We'll see if we can make a comeback. Uh, this is King Rev, and you're on the kingdom, and we will see you next time.